What's up friends, Arthur Solomon here, coming at you live. We're here in the beautiful Tremont City, a house that's completely remodeled right behind me, 11 West Main Street. We actually have it open today from uh, 12 to one. If you're looking for a new house and pretty much a brand new house in Northwestern School District, everything has been redone, everything has been uh, touched in this house. It's a great property here. I'm gonna walk you through it, give you a quick walkthrough. We'll just start on the outside here. So it's literally right downtown here, North, uh, not Northampton, Tremont City, uh, German Township, Northwestern Schools. This, this is actually a little park here for a veterans park. What's up, babe? Thanks for tuning in. This yard, so this used to be, this yard used to be much smaller, but they've added on to this property since the post office burned down. So there used to be a post office here. Uh, the property goes back to the tree line there, just a little bit into the tree line. There's a creek, Chapman Creek, that runs right through it. So here we go. Here we've got the house. We've got uh, almost 2,600 square feet. We've got a 24 by 30 garage out back completely remodeled new windows we got a slate roof on here white vinyl siding look at this big wraparound porch it's got two and a half baths imagine having a little barbecue and you've got this little area here you can put a couple rocking chairs or a swing there's two entry doors so that'll take you into the dining room and then this one will take us into the living room there's a family room, living room, dining room, utility room, more pantry, and also an office or a bedroom down here. The welcome. We've got a brand new Anderson door, storm door. A lot of original features, woodwork, drywall, insulation, flooring, whole nine yards. Yeah, I love that porch too. Tim, thanks for tuning in. Appreciate it. Beautiful fireplace, one of two fireplaces with a mantle, all original woodwork. Here we've got one of the owners here. Did a great job, he's tired getting some rest so we've got ceiling fans in here crown moldings the whole nine yards look at that beautiful mantle with the mirror right there this actually has some pocket doors that are in the garage in case you wanted to put those back on if you wanted to you can actually make this maybe another bedroom if you wanted to or an office it's got these pocket doors that are still working so this is a, a cool little area here you can hang up your coats and stuff like that that'll go upstairs we'll go up there next take a look at this guys this is a beautiful, this is a massive dining room in here. This is really like two rooms in one. It's got built-ins, a lot of cool features like this. Hey, Jeff, thanks for tuning in. Look at all original. This house was originally built in 1905. You should see the foundation walls. They're about two feet thick. Massive, massive, solid foundation. Just a lot of great features in here. All new drywall in here, new windows in here. Parquet floors in here, kitchen. Guys, look at this kitchen. This is amazing. Quality, quality work. Uh, this is all done by Flora Builders and uh, ACJ LLC, uh, Contractors LLC. Brand new cabinets, uh, stainless steel appliances. Look at this, the color of the stove in here. What do you guys think? That's so cool, I think. And this is an air fryer as well, stove and an air fryer. Those are very popular right now. Subway tile with the ribbon cut right through. Granite all over the place stainless steel sink farm sink extra deep gfi switches outlets everything's updated this is a pretty cool little feature right here as well you guys think about that that's custom made right here and that's custom made and this uh, cutting board actually comes with it as well it's all custom made refrigerator is brand new there's well over ten thousand dollars in appliances in this house alone so this this wasn't even here. Matter of fact, if you guys want to see the pictures, they're on realtor.com or on my website, Cobble Bankers Home or Sold by Solomon. You can take a look at some of the pictures, original pictures of how this kitchen looked. I mean, we've got crown molding in here. We've got all the fine finishes. This was a, a full bathroom down here with a shower. We ended up getting this converted to a just a half bath off the kitchen. New luxury vinyl plank floors. Everything was brand new in here. New plumbing, new water lines, new electric, GFIs. Everything is done very, very properly. So now we're going to the uh, pantry area. You've also got the washer and dryer in here. It's a big room. It used to be a porch, it's been converted over, it's heated. I'll show you the vent here in just a second. So this goes out the backyard to your uh, 24 by 30 garage, as well as overlooks the backyard. So your washer and dryer goes right here. And then you can have a, a pantry area and some upper cabinets and things like that, soaking sink. So here's uh, the heat here. And this is, listen, if you have an office now or, or if you have like a mother-in-law or you want some, you want an extra bedroom on the main level, take a look at this, guys. So this has got a brand new drop ceiling, new lights. It's got a private entrance. It's heated. 
It's got a brand new deck here. So the well used to be out here. The well is now on the other side of the house. Brand new driveway, gravel crushed driveway here. Extra parking. The basement is a walkout basement. And I'll show you that. It's got a ton of space down there as well. So a lot of extra parking here. Updated electric. Take a look at this. It's 200 amp service. And then there's a sub panel here. Then there's a sub panel in the garage. And then there's also another one upstairs. Like I said, all the pocket doors work. All the original features are still here. Super cool. Hey, Josh, thanks for tuning in, brother man. Appreciate it. So again, living room, dining room, that was just behind this. And this is a family room or, or an office or a potential bedroom. And then we'll go up here, up the stairs. Beautiful woodwork all throughout. Polished everything up. Just looks incredible. Like a brand new house. And there's three bedrooms up here. So we're here we're, we've got the landing. And then there's even a little extra storage area in here. T-Mac, what's going on, brother? Man, it was fun today. Let's do it again soon. Ashley, thanks for tuning in. T-Mac told me, don't sell all the homes. Come on, man. You know how we do it. So a big closet in here with racks on both sides. Every uh, closet's got a light as well. So a big room in here, full bathroom with a stand-up shower, marble tops, some extra storage in here. Everything nice, clean, moving, ready. Six panel doors, trim, ceiling fans in two of the three rooms up here. There is also an attic as well. So this is the hallway bathroom in here now. Again, marble top, luxury vinyl plank flooring. This has got the soaking tub. You got kids, you need to throw them in the bathroom, uh, bathtub, there you go. Brand new carpet throughout. Uh, they ended up keeping this right here, which I feel like is, is a really cool feature. This is the old uh, fireplace downstairs. Uh, it's got a brand new furnace, so this is not used anymore. It's got a uh, high efficiency furnace now. So bedroom two, all really nice sized bedrooms as you can see. Beautiful house. Thank you, Ashley, appreciate it. Yeah, there's a lot of work. Over nine months of work went into this house. Take a look at some of the before pictures if you're interested on Realtor.com or Zillow or Truly or whatever, and you'll be able to see this thing was a mess. It was completely gutted up here down to the studs. So closet in here, there's a separate light for it. And then the last bedroom up here. Appreciate that, T-Mac. Nice. Yes, sir. Another closet in here. So if you're looking for a big house or if you have some in-laws that are living with you or if you got some grown kids, need some privacy, you've got that area downstairs with a private bedroom. This is like a, more or less a closet area, but this is also a walkthrough to the attic. So it's got a full attic. Let me just give you a quick peek up here. That's a little dark, but there's over 16 inches, over 16 inches of insulation right here, blown insulation, brand new stuff up here. Very well insulated house, very efficient. So we'll go downstairs to the basement. I'll show you that. All the utilities. It's got a brand new well, brand new septic, new water lines, new drain line. Expanding family. Absolutely beautiful house. Thank you, Tim. Thank you, babe. Appreciate it. Here we go. Down here in the basement. This is a full walkout basement. There's the door. So that walks us out to the driveway side. Brand new sump pump in here. Like I said, these walls are about two feet thick. This is like a fortress. So tornado shelter or anything like that. This has got brand new uh, block basement windows, brand new furnace over here, bunch of new duct work. If you have a hobby room or if you just wanna throw some gym equipment or whatever, just take a look at all the space. You just got extra stuff, Christmas stuff, all the holiday stuff, bring it down here. So new water heater in here. Uh, it's a gas, a gas water heater and it's vented right there through the side. New pressure tank. Well is on this side of the house now. So let me go give you guys the bonus now, the garage. This is what I need right here. 24 by 30 garage. You guys have any questions so far? Hey Ashley, thanks for joining us, appreciate it. If you guys have any questions, drop them below.
right, we've got the crew over here. Well, not working too hard. But look at this garage, guys. Big garage. It's got a garage door opener. Don't be shy. If you guys have any questions, uh, just DM me. Put them in the in the comment section below. 11 West Main Street. And then Tim, he's out doing two open houses today as well. We've got another house, 420 South Belmont Avenue. It's a three to four bedroom, one and a half bath, one car garage, uh, 2,070 square feet, big, big house. And it's on sale for 105. We just listed it and it's probably gonna be gone. So if you're interested in that, 12 to one, see it with Tim or your realtor. And uh, we also have another house, one bedroom, one bath, Clark Shawnee School District, just south of 70, close to Columbus. And it's gonna be from 1.30 to 2.30 today with Tim. Address is 401 Lyle, if you guys are interested. 420 Belmont, yes. Yeah, 420 Belmont, sorry if I said something else. Uh, 420 South Belmont, Sprinkler, Ohio, 45505 from 12 to one, and then 130 to 230 will be 401 Lyle. Seat with Tim, if you're interested, one bedroom, one bath, super clean, everything, all the appliances, moving ready. Guys, thank you so much for, for watching. Appreciate you, and hope you have a great day.